All right, guys, we're ready for Tyco SafeWatch Pro 3000 EN system test number 13. So I've got my KAC call points hooked up here. The one with the red cable is on the fire zone. And the one with the green and black wire bundle is hooked up to the burglary zone. You can see I have my Honeywell 6272 CSV down below. The ELK 120 voice driver is inside of the panel and it is hooked up to my Moose MPI-35R speaker. There's the box to the speaker. I'm not going to do an overview video on it because it's like a super basic speaker. Um, anyway, let's go ahead and start testing out here. We'll start with the fire zone. Okay, so you may have noticed that with the fire, the fire sequence on the uh, voice driver, it does have a little bit of a glitch to it. Um, unlike my other Elk voice drivers, this one does not have a quote-unquote starting tone when you're doing the, I believe what's called the combo trigger effect. Um... It just starts off with the Yelp tone, and then it goes to the uh, temporal horn. That kind of annoys me just a little bit because um, I don't, I just don't like the not so smooth transition on it. Um, another thing is, is that if you cut the power, or if the power to the voice driver is cut. Well, not to the voice driver itself, obviously, but to the uh, voice input line. If that input voltage is cut, then um, the voice driver, you would think, would just stop broadcasting. But instead, if you're like within uh, one of the voice messages on there, when the power gets cut to it, it will play through the entire voice message instead of just chopping right at the uh right at that exact moment anyway uh next up here is gonna be burglary zone but first we've gotta arm it to something so we'll arm it to night's day night's day and we'll let it do its little arm sequence here um I really do like the Elk 120 voice recordable module, um, mainly because of its adjustable volume setting. Um, if I ever decide to, I'm going to try to get a uh, Elk 129 programmable module that you that would be used to put wave audio files onto the voice driver. Uh, unfortunately, they are a little bit expensive, and now you can see yeah. that the system is armed, and it's giving me a night armed night trouble because the relays are missing. And we'll just back out of there, and then we'll activate this and wait.
Alright, so that is the Tyco SafeWatch Pro 3000EN system test number 13. And the functional test of the KAC, I gotta get the box out here. KAC MCP1A-R470SF-STCK-01 call points. And the ELK120 recordable voice siren driver. Rate, comment, like, subscribe, you know the drill, and I'll see you guys later.